10 life hacks that you definitely need to try. This video will be useful for many of you as there are some amazing hacks that will make your life a little bit easier. First is a tip on how to keep brown sugar soft for a long time. The main issue I have while storing brown sugar is that it becomes hard as a rock after some time. But I understood that if you cover the jar in which you store the brown sugar with a cling wrap and then put the lid, it stays soft for months. Here is a jar which was filled 4 to 5 months back. It was fully filled to the brim and the sugar is still soft now without any lumps. So I can definitely say that this hack works. I saw this hack day before yesterday on Pinterest and I knew it would be very useful for me. I really like the thin slices of butter I got through the peeler. If you bake cakes often, you've probably noticed that many recipes instruct you to line your cake pans with the baking paper. It might sound like an unnecessary step but in reality it makes it so much easier to get the cake out of its pan once baked. So here is a hack on how you can cut the baking paper into perfect rounds. For this, first you have to fold the sheet in half and then you have to fold it again and then fold it diagonally as shown in the video here. Flip your cake pan over and place the triangle on top so that the tip of the triangle touches the center of the pan. Then use your scissors to cut the parchment paper or the baking paper along the outer curve of the pan. And that's it. Once you unfold the piece of paper in your hand, you should be left with a round that fits perfectly inside your pan. We find it very tough to close RKG ghee tin's lid. So what my mom does is she saves the lid of Quaker Oats or small Nido tin and uh, uses it to close the RKG ghee tin. It fits perfectly and it's very easy to open and close with this lid too. Fabric lampshades accumulates a lot of dust and it looks very untidy especially if it is white like what I have here. For delicate fabric lampshades use a clean lint roller to sweep off the dust from top to bottom. Here is a genius and convenient bin liner hack. All you have to do is uh, turn the bag upside down and put it like a hat on top of the trash bin and then push the top of the bag downwards. Sounds logical and convenient, doesn't it? You can store fruits and vegetables longer by washing it in a solution with vinegar. So for that, just put the fruits in a bowl and then fill it with water and add about two to three tablespoons of vinegar let it sit there for uh, three minutes and drain it and uh, rinse it again with water and then this step is very important you have to really let the strawberries or whatever fruit you're washing dry and uh, remove as much moisture as possible Place the fruits in a container lined with the tissue paper, the kitchen tissue and then uh, place another kitchen tissue on top and then close it and store it in the refrigerator. Uh, like this, the fruits and vegetables will stay fresh for a longer time. You can store cut pieces of potatoes in the refrigerator without it changing color by immersing it in water. Whenever you need it, just drain and use. But I don't store this uh, for more than a week. 
Whenever I go to the grocery store, I try to wash the fruits and vegetables with vinegar solution and store it so that I can see what's in the fridge and make sure that I use all of it before it goes bad. If you plan on baking something and uh, you forgot to let your butter come to room temperature ahead of time, use this quick and easy method. Heat on defrost mode which is uh, on 30% power in the microwave oven for 15 seconds and uh, you get perfectly softened butter. Here is a clever hack on how to stop all your baby wipes coming out at once. It just requires placing an elastic band or hair band around one end of the pack. And there you go, you just get one wipe at a time. While shooting this video, I also came across a lot of failed hacks and here are some of those. I saw in uh, Pinterest that you can remove the induction stuff top stains by adding baking soda and lemon juice. I tried that and all the sizzle and all that happened but uh, and I wiped it for a long time but the stain is still there it didn't work well for me. I read that if you place a hot glass that had boiling water over cold butter and place it in that position for 10 to 15 minutes the butter will soften but it didn't work for me. Another failed hack was trying to remove tags with tape but I think it might work if I try it on smooth surfaces. This hack looked very cool when I saw someone else doing it on Pinterest but uh, when I tried to do it uh, my spoon started bending. <laughs> This old kitchen trick that stops boiling milk from quickly overflowing on the stove top didn't quite work for me as well. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. That's all in this video. If you guys have any uh, clever hacks that you would want me to try, please let me know in the comments. If you like this video, please do share it with your family and friends.